So we are now at the A-Liner booth here at RVX. This is a really, really cool trailer. I had to stop and video this simply because a lot of folks love these tiny little portable compact trailers. So I am here with Brett Randall, who is the CEO of the company. Hey, Brett, how are you doing today? I'm doing great, J.D. Nice to meet you, and thanks great. for stopping by. Not a problem. So, if you can, educate me a little bit on the A-Liner. Sure. Let me uh, A-Liner is uh, uh, our, our company name and our leading brand. Uh, but I'll start here with our Escape brand. This is our uh, 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 travel trailer. Uh, we have a couple of different floor plans for it. Uh, it's designed really to be for one or two people. Uh, very lightweight, towable, uh, all under 2,000 pounds, so towable by many vehicles. Uh, and it's uh, uh, designed to be uh, 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 used with smart technology. We've added some packages now that uh, uh, a smart package that contains the ability with a keyless entry as well as uh, uh, the ability to operate and control your thermostat uh, and your speakers uh, with an app in your phone. Oh, that's cool. Uh, so we're pretty excited about that. That's new here uh, for RVX. Uh, and this is uh, uh, about a two-year-old uh, model that we have, and, and uh, it's grown pretty fast for us, so we're pretty excited. You know, one thing I notice is just the curves, the aerodynamic lines, the fact that everything has a very, very nice cosmetic look, but overall it's a very clean, functional look. What would you say your typical buyer would tow one of these with? Well, we, we would have uh, everybody, uh, we have a lot of hybrids or crossovers. Uh, we, we do have uh, 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 some with uh, heavier towing vehicles, but it, it really depends. Uh, this is a, a very nice trailer we find for uh, uh, somebody who's a single person or a couple uh, mm -hmm. that are looking to use it either on a weekend warrior basis or if they're looking to do uh, uh, see the country and its wonderful sights. Okay. So it's uh, uh, both fully loaded. We have uh, a model that has a a shower and a toilet in it. Uh, it's got a, a, a dinette and folds into a bed, uh, equipped with uh, a sound package, uh, fridge, sink, stove, microwave, uh, and then uh, we've got uh, uh, an options as well for uh, a potty version as well if, if, if folks don't want to use the, uh, uh, the full shower in it. Okay, and I see you have an awning on the back as we well. We do. We do have the Thule awning on the back, and you can see on this one it's, it's folded out. It is a rear entry, uh, which is which is nice. And, and one of the things you can see is that we have a design, a patented step in here. So the uh, uh, the headroom is a little bit yeah. more substantial than a lot of the smaller uh, travel trailers. This is very cool. Now, what I like about this is that it appears as if you really have everything you would need to take this out for a few days and not feel as if you're really lacking anything aside from space if you're looking for something larger. But this is a really nice layout. So, you know, when people are buying these new mid-size pickup trucks, Canyon, Colorados, things like that, the new Ranger, this really seems like the perfect size trailer to haul behind one of those without any concern, really, of sway or other issues, simply because it's so light. It is. It is so light, J.D. And, and the other thing we found is is with uh, uh, our, our, our shape, the aerodynamic towing ability on it, it tows very, very nicely. And so a lot of folks, whether they have a larger... Uh, uh, tow vehicle with more horses like it, uh, as well as those who, who may have a little bit less. It, it tows very well for them. So uh, this is uh, our Escape travel trailer uh, model. Maybe we'll take a look now at our uh, A-Liner product. And real quick, what would the MSRP on a unit like this be as equipped? Uh, well, that's a good question, and, and it'll vary around the country, uh, some of it due to, to, to freight and dealers, but uh, uh, these products, uh, the Escape product in general, uh, we'll start to retail in, in the mid-teens and then could go up into the light 20s. That's really not that bad. Awesome. Yeah, let's go take a look at some of the other ones. Great. Okay, Brent, so what are we looking at here? Well, now we're looking at our, our A-liner fold-up trailer, and it pops up into an A-frame, as you can see over here. We can set it up one person, two hands, 30 seconds to set it up. And uh, uh, this is our, uh, uh, our flagship model. Uh, we're actually celebrating 35 years uh, this year of making the A-frame, so we've introduced a couple of uh, anniversary trailers that I'll show you. But this one we're very excited about. This we're calling our new family trailer. And the nice thing about this is that it comfortably can sleep four adults. Let's take a look. So you have the ability here uh, uh, for uh, 
a, a double queen in, in the back here, and then you have uh, uh, two single beds here that are designed well to be uh, for four adults or a family of four, uh, which which we've been getting a lot of requests for is is that. Uh, 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 families who uh, love and maybe are getting out of the tent area but want to still have uh, the feel of canvas or a hard dormer on it. And it's equipped, uh, there's many options here. This one has an indoor sink. This could be uh, a potty option as well. And then what we have done here is designed a pull-out kitchen. Oh, that's cool. So this is nice for the family who enjoys uh, the camping scenario. This comes with uh, uh, a cooler and a stove. Uh, there's also a sink option back here. You have a cutting board and a place for your silverware. So it's very designed nicely for outdoor camping. What I like is you kind of bring that European, kind of Australian flair that a lot of people want to the U.S. This is really cool. Thank you, J.D., and, and as you said earlier, you can see the, the uh, original designs were just with the A-frame. Over the last five years, we've added what we call dormers, which really open up the space in the interior and give you a lot more room. They're available in canvas, but they're also available in a hard wall as well. You can see this model, which is one of our 35th anniversary trailers that we did. We did one here in, a, in red, and I'll show you one in blue. Uh, and it has a hard double dormer on it and an off-road beefy package here. So it's a, it's a bold unit, and we're excited to offer it this year, celebrating our 35th year in business. That's cool. Let's take a look inside this one. Sure. This one has a, a convertible area here for uh, uh, sleeping arrangements. You have a sink, a refrigerator inside, and then you'll have a, a dinette with a pedestal here that can also be converted into a bed. Okay. So comfortably sleeps three people. So when you put a restroom, is it one of those cassette style restrooms? It would be, yes. A cassette potty uh, is the option that we have uh, in the models. See, I like this. I like the harder sections here. And I'm not a big canvas person in that sense, but at the same time, this is something that would be really nice to park outside of a lake. It would be really, really nice to park on the beach. This is just a very, very comfortable cozy setup, especially if you're only going to be out for a couple days, maybe. Well, and you're right, J.D., and, and obviously uh, uh, in many parks now, uh, uh, canvas isn't, a, isn't an option for folks, so having the ability to have the hard dormer uh, gives them the security that they're looking for, uh, as well as the ability to get that additional space, because for the sleeping arrangements, having uh, the little pop-up really makes, as you can see, it really opens up the dinette area as well, and you, you can stand in it fully when you're not set up for the dinette. Absolutely. So MSRP on a unit like this, what's the range? Uh, you, you would be in the 15 to 20 range. Still not too bad. Yes. We Very try nice. to keep the products, as many of them as we can, under 2,000 pounds uh, and uh, keep them affordable uh, and designed as well for uh, uh, potential for, for families. Awesome. Well, Brent, be able to I really appreciate your time. Thank you very much. It was a pleasure to meet you, and thank you very much for stopping by a -Liner. Absolutely. Guys, if you haven't had a chance, please take a moment, subscribe to my channel, give me a thumbs up. We'll talk to you again very soon.